Parasol, welcome back to another video. Today we are going to be doing a haul of the new collaboration with Tammy Hembro and In The Style. I've been following Tammy Hembro for quite some time and I'm assuming that you guys already know who she is. But if you don't, she is like a huge Instagrammer. She has like 7 million followers on Instagram. She has a YouTube channel. She does like fitness, stuff like that. And when I heard she was doing a collaboration with In The Style, of course, I could not help myself. I had to check it out and I ended up buying quite a few things. So if you guys want to see what I think of the collaboration, definitely keep on watching. I've never bought anything from In The Style before. This is my first time. I've heard a lot of things about In The Style on like Instagram and stuff like that. So I'm really, really excited to try it for myself today. So if you guys are interested to see this video, definitely keep on watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe if you enjoy. And let's begin. So I think the first thing that I'm going to try on is this dress. It's like a mini v-neck suede dress so i'm gonna try this one on first okay so this is the first dress this is the red suede mini dress which is a v-neck and as you can see showing a lot of cleavage it's very sexy and i think it's gorgeous like let me just throw it out there the suede is really, really nice the color is banging but unfortunately as we can clearly see it is way too short for me like this is like a t-shirt right now so um, <laughs> I really really like it like I think it is absolutely stunning but it's just way too short for me I do think Tammy compared to me obviously as most of you know I am very very tall I'm about 5'11 so I'm assuming Tammy is probably the average height of a, of a woman which is probably like 5'5 five, five, maybe even shorter so these dresses are definitely not for taller women because I'm all here for a short skirt and I like, you know, to show my legs a bit, but this is just, it's just way too short. Like if I bend over, everything is going to be out. So I can't, I definitely wouldn't be able to wear it. But if you're short on, you're looking for a party dress, I think this dress is so banging. I got this in a size 10 and it fits okay. It's a little bit short in the sleeves, but I think that's just because I'm taller, I've got longer arms. They have this in the black the white and the red I believe and I think the red look at the red like this is show stopping this is really really nice I'm so upset that I can't keep it I just know I wouldn't feel comfortable if I go out like this but other than that I think this dress is absolutely gorgeous so this dress was actually 40 pounds which ugh, it's quite expensive for just a um, v-neck dress, but it is absolutely lovely. Like I said, if I was shorter and it was a little bit longer on me, I would definitely be keeping this. I wouldn't return it. Um, but it's just the length that isn't working for me. But other than that, I definitely recommend it. I just really wish, I really wish it was longer because I would actually like to keep this. Like, it's just so nice, but tall girl problems tall girl problems okay so the next thing is this two piece you've got the crop top and then you've got the leggings and i don't know if you can see on camera but they have like this glittery effect so it is black but then it's got like this silver kind of glitter to it and i really really like this bought a lot of these kind of cord stuff but i just can't get enough because i think they're so cash but so dressy at the same time like you can wear them as many ways as you want so when i saw this and i saw the glitter detail i was like hells yes and it fits amazingly i got a 12 in the top and the 10 in the bottoms and to be honest i feel like the 10 is a little bit big it's not big enough that i need to return it and get a 8 but it is quite big so if you're deciding on what size to get with the leggings i would probably recommend sizing down just because obviously you want them to be tight you don't want them to be baggy and i just feel like mine are a little bit baggy here which i don't like in terms of length they're super super long as you can see they go down all the way to my feet which i'm really happy with it is a little bit itchy i think because of the material of the glitter it's itching my legs a little bit but it's nothing that um i can't deal with i think the little glittery detail just makes it look more glamish makes it look more dressy it's giving me some hips giving me some booty so i really really like this the leggings were 27 pounds and the top was 15 pounds so i think the top is a reasonable price the leggings a little bit you know a little bit pricey just for leggings on their own but considering they're glittery that's probably why they're that price um it's super super high waisted so you don't have to worry about you know the stomach showing if you don't like to show your stomach but overall i'm really really happy with this i think it's absolutely gorgeous and yeah thumbs up from me so this is one of the jumpsuits um i don't know if you can see all the way down but they kind of flare out um and it obviously has this big cut out detail and has a little bit of 
what is it called? Under boob cleavage? I'm not sure. But um, if I'm honest, I wasn't really sure about this when I saw it on the website. I saw it and I thought, wow, that is a lot. Like, I, I don't mind showing some skin, but I've never shown like the under boob here. So I was a little bit like, I'm not sure if I want to try it or not, but I thought I might as well. And I don't love it, if I'm honest. I just don't think it's my type of style i think it fits amazingly i've got this in a size 12 and the length is really really good as you can see they like flare at the bottom sorry i can't show you everything i think it's really nice and even though it does have the under cleavage you can kind of make it more revealing or less revealing if you get what i mean so it can look like that or it can look like a lot of cleavage is out that is just down to you but in terms for me i just don't really know if it's my style this is what the back looks like so the back is out as well then you can see the zip and yeah i don't know i just don't love this as much as like what i just tried on this was actually 40 pounds and for a jumpsuit i will say the quality is really really good but i just don't know if this is really me like i don't know if i'd feel confident to leave the house like this in terms of wearing a bra like yeah, there's no way you can wear a bra with this because your bra's either going to be showing underneath or showing here. So you definitely can't wear a bra with this. So if you're someone that likes to wear bras, I would probably say this is a no. But um, it is gorgeous. It is a nice jumpsuit. It feels and fits really nice. I just don't know if it's really my style. So this is another one of her dresses. This is obviously a longer one. I think it says midi on there. So um, that's why it's fitting me a lot better. And then it has a slip right here. And then it kind of like ties at the back, as you can see. So all of this is showing and then you've got the tie at the back. And I'm not really sure what this color is. It's like a nude, pinky kind of color. I think this dress is really, really pretty. I feel like it's more of a, an occasions dress. Like I wouldn't really wear this on a night out. I like this little detailing. It's a lot different. I've never had a dress like this before. I don't feel like I'm showing way too much. Whereas the other dress I was just showing a bit too much, if you know what I mean. So I think it's very nice and classy. It's sucking my stomach in, which I like, okay? And the length is really, really good. So um, this dress was actually £35 and I picked it up in a size 12. And to be honest, if I would have got a 10, it just wouldn't have fit me with like the boobs and everything. So I'm happy I got a 12. But um, I think this dress is really, really pretty. I think for the price, it's not that unreasonable. Um... But yeah, the only thing I don't like is that it's that type of material that creases and I find materials like this and dresses like this really, really hard to iron. So there is a little bit of crease and I don't know if you can see that I'm going to obviously have to iron out or do something with. That's the only thing that I'm not really that happy with because I just hate having to iron things that shouldn't really need to be ironed if you go know what I mean. So um, that's the only thing I don't like but other than that I think the dress is lovely and I'm definitely keeping this one. Okay so this is another one of her cords but instead this is actually trousers and then the bardeau. Um, I don't know if I'm loving this one. I think I don't like the material that they use. I feel like if they were to use the same material as like the black jumpsuit and a similar colour, then I think I'd like it a little bit more. But again, it's one of those materials that just always crease and are just so hard to iron, which are just so annoying to me because I hate ironing on a good day. So I'm not the best when it comes to ironing. But um, I think it's pretty. I think I get where they were going. I just don't love the material, but that's just my preference. It fits really nice um it's really really long as well and i just don't know if it just suits me that much i don't know what do you guys think because sometimes i'll be looking at stuff and i'll be like no taras that looks horrible on you then someone else can be like it looks really nice so let me guys let me know what you guys think if you think it's nice on me or if it's not i don't really love it so at the moment i'm not really sure about it so the trousers were 28 pounds and then the top was 20 pounds so I think for the trousers and for the top, it's not unreasonable. The price isn't that bad, but I just don't love the satin material. I, I'm just not a fan of it. So on, it, on me now, I just don't really love it. So this is one of her crop tops, her bardo tops. And then it's like a pleated fabric with the flare sleeves. This I'm not really that mad at. I think with these bardo tops can look cute with so many different things and they're good to kind of have in your wardrobe it does come with matching trousers similar to these ones but obviously the same material i don't i don't think i would like the trousers so i just decided to get the top and as i was trying it on i noticed that there's a little bit of a hole which isn't 
that bad i know if i say that they'll they'll probably either refund me or give me another top but i'm just not obsessed with it i think on the pictures the sleeves looked a little bit wider which is what i liked but obviously with the whole set it will probably look better um i'm not really sure about this one so the top was 20 pounds and i got it in a size 10 the size is okay i do like the pleats and i do like like the top is um flared and that it's really really long so that's probably the reason why i might keep it but i'm just not sure for now so this is the last item i got it's another jumpsuit but as you can see it's a little bit different at the um at the front it is like a crisscross shows a little bit of your belly a lot of cleavage um kind of jumpsuit which i really really like if i'm honest again the length is super super long which i'm really impressed with but i think i got too much of a big size i got this in a size 12 i probably should have got a 10 i don't know why i thought a 10 would be too small but it is definitely too big for me so i definitely need to change it and this was 40 pounds i think this is really really gorgeous i love red at the moment like i'm all here for red clothing and i think this is just such a nice standout piece again it is creased so you're gonna have to iron this and again i don't even think wearing a bra would be possible if you get this so definitely keep that in mind yeah, i really really like the jumpsuit i just wish i got a smaller size so if you're thinking about if you need to size up or size down i would say just stick to the size that you normally would get because it fits really really well okay guys so that is it for today's video i really hope you enjoyed it overall I have to say the collaboration was really, really good. I'm really, really impressed with Tammy and Inda Styles collaboration collection. I think the stuff was very on trend, quite true to her. Like I feel like what she was wearing is quite similar to what she normally wears on like Instagram and stuff like that. I am impressed with majority of everything that I got. As you would have seen, there was a few things that I didn't like, but I think it was a really, really nice collection. So I definitely recommend that you shop the collection with Tammy and In The Style. Like I said, it was my first time buying something from In The Style and it definitely won't be my last. I think the quality for the most part was really, really good. Pricing, some things were okay. Some were a little bit, you know, I would, I would have liked it to be a little bit cheaper but overall it's nothing out of the ordinary so the pricing was okay it came really really far so i have no negatives about shopping on in the style whatsoever but if you guys have enjoyed this video please let me know by leaving me a like commenting and subscribing to my channel please in the comment section let me know what you think about what i've tried on today and if you've tried the collection and what you tried and anything leave anything in those comment sections trust me i want to know and i want to know what you guys think so please please do that for me but other than that guys thank you once more for watching and i'll catch you in the next one bye guys Mwah.